today we're here in beautiful North Charleston at Stokes Mazda Superstore and we're going to be taking a look at the Dodge Ram 3500 with the Cummings diesel up under the hood. Pretty big truck isn't it folks? It sure is. Now right now it's kind of kind of forgetting what year model it is but it's a 2006 with uh, 266,000 miles on it but you know they've always said that doesn't really make a big deal with those diesel engines with high mileage they're meant to do that kind of stuff so today mostly what we're going to be doing checking out the current condition of the truck if we see any day, uh, dents things scratches imperfections i'll point them out to you on camera this truck again is a 2006 so take that in consideration and there may be a few things here or there so let's go ahead and start off on the front end you definitely know it's a dodge ram just by looking at it it's got that big Ram logo on the front, the big headlights, and then again, it's a dually, right? So it's definitely going to have the towing power and to be able to get out there on the roads and get the job done. Tires are in good shape. You got the mud flaps, the chrome wheels, big horn addition. Wow, okay, it's going to have some nice features. Got the lights up top on the roof. It's four door. How about that? Even got a toolbox in the back. Nice. Um, we do have some oxidation going on and some paint chipping back here on that back panel as you can see just want to point that out to you um, which is pretty common on vehicles that were made in the early to mid 2000s uh, paint just I don't know what they were doing when they were painting these vehicles but they were using a certain type of paint that made it do that okay but who knows again it's many years later let's take a look at these dually tires on the back there's your rims there's your two dually tires. Again, they're not brand new tires. They're good years, though. And they still have a pretty decent amount of tread on them. There's your back tailgate. Of course, it's got the tow package. Got a massive size third brake light. Do have some scratching and some dents right up in here. Again, you know, someone with a truck like this, they're definitely using it to pull a massive load. And it uh, looks like this one might have had a car trailer or uh, some kind of fifth wheel off the back. If it didn't, then it wouldn't be, you know, having all that stuff going on back there. Uh, this side on this quarter panel, the paint is a lot better, as you can see. Except for got another little spot right there. Uh, it does have a back window opens and closes, so you can throw that lab dog a bone if he's sitting in the back while you're cruising around town. Um, again, it's an SLT 2006 Ram 3500 5.9 liter engine under the hood. And uh, mileage on this one is 255-240. 255-240. Power windows, power door locks, got the fake wood trim there, cloth interior seats. We do have some wear going on right there on your seat, as you can see, but it's not ripped completely through where you can see the uh, padding. Again, normal things on an older truck. I mean, again, people are getting in and out all the time, getting the job done. Does have actually LED lights up in the roof there, which is kind of neat, unless the guy just switched out the color of the bulbs. Um, there's your uh, transmission. Look at that, it's a manual. How about that? That's different, so no automatic in this one. Four-wheel drive, brake gain, all the stuff you're looking for. CD player, auxiliary port, and I'm sure the AC blows nice and cold. And you got a massive size center armrest that folds up as a center seat. In the back here, pretty decent amount of room in the second row as well. Still smells pretty good on the inside. Doesn't, uh, doesn't have any weird, odd smells about it. It's a pretty decent truck for what it is, folks. Come on down and see it today at Stokes Mazda. It's towards the end of June 2017. We'd love to see you. If you're watching on YouTube right now, hit that subscribe, like, and send me a comment. Let me know what you think about the Cummings Turbo Diesel. We'll see you soon.